Hello everyone, welcome to this plant protection class. In this class, we will explain the calibration of the SP5 spreader. The specific calibration operation is as follows. Install the SP5 spreader in the aircraft after removing the centrifugal disc. Open the Plant Protection Assistant app, click Spread Settings and Settings, click the Reset button of the weight sensor, and check whether the values of the corresponding sensors 1, 2, 3, and 4 are correct. Click the Calibration button and click the plus sign in the interface that pops up in the Material selection above to add the material name. Click Start Calibration, select the roller to use, select the actual dosage range, click Next, empty the material box, and place the container below the aircraft rack. View the aircraft deviation angle in the left view, and the deviation angle should be less than 2. Click Next and click the Tear button. If calibrations do not require repeated tearing, you can choose to skip. Click Next, fill the medicine box with materials so that the calibration results will be more accurate. Click Finish. Click Start Calibration, wait for calibration to complete, check if the generated curve is flat, and click Finish. After removing the spreader from the drone and installing the centrifugal plate of the SP5 spreader, it can be used normally on the drone. Notes. When calibrating, the aircraft should be placed horizontally. If the deviation angle is too large, it will cause calibration failure. Do not shake the aircraft during calibration, otherwise it will also cause calibration failure. Do not apply extra force to the material box during calibration, such as pressing it with your hands. Fill up the materials. If the materials are insufficient, it will lead to inaccurate usage per care and deviated operation results. If the calibration curve is not smooth enough after calibration, you can try to calibrate it several times. Above all is the content of this class. Follow the Top Gun channel for more plant protection skills.